back with more Ninth at Dawn Part 3 here. I know these videos are coming one after another, but, uh, yeah, so I did find a little bandit here. I robbed him of his shit, and, uh, yeah, we got an Iron War Axe. Um, how we've been at the torch. We also have a Barbed Arrow, and, uh, that's pretty much about it. We've gotten, like, meat and a few other stuff, but, um, we did find a boat. <laughs> Um, but anyways, yeah, still exploring here. It seems like we've hit a pinnacle of, uh, just like we hit a way in the corner of Agaria. Um, so places I have not searched was probably the lower part of Agaria. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and, uh, try to do that real quick. Search Agar- oh god, these guys are stupid fast. Yeah. Stupid fast and stupid strong. So you can search these mushrooms here, and sometimes you, you can uh, get mushrooms, which is weird. I don't know how you search mushrooms. I'm absolutely scared of my surroundings right now. Since I'm in such a dense patch of forest here. Um, <clears throat> so here we are in Agaria. Um, we got a snake here. Dropped a bronze hammer. How does a snake even carry a hammer? It should carry something like maybe meat or something like that, but no, it carries a fucking bronze hammer. Let's check that out. <laughs> like, what, what, how does that even work? Um, I'll be using my face cam next, um, next episode. Uh, I think this game will look better with the face cam involved. <clears throat> okay, bronze hammer. It has nothing I uh, need from it. <laughs> we can also use the arrow and equip that. That's another way to save up on magic, but I don't want to uh, um, unexhaust my magic. So, yeah. Black spikes usually happen when we get close enough to this town. Weird enough. Alright, so I think I'm going to go south from uh, this little town of Agari, I guess, and see what leads over there. There is a little trail here. <clears throat> We're gonna see where that takes us. This is a nice little village here. <clears throat> the mini-map even shows the town, so that's that way I can keep up uh, with where I'm going. So we're gonna go to the south here, see if we can find anything, because obviously there's something down here in the cave, southeast of here. Holy shit. <clears throat> I did not even see those little creatures. They're fucking ugly. But hey, we got some stuff over here. Let's check that out. <clears throat> it's a glaive. So that's what a glaive looks like. I thought a glaive was kind of like a boomerang, but a circular boomerang. Um, <clears throat> holy shit, that has a lot of value to it. Let me see the attack. Attack is 11. Nah, fuck that. Uh, let's get this shit out of my inventory. I don't think I uh, want it anymore. Team Masterina can suck my dick with her quests. We still have to accomplish them though. <clears throat> I'm gonna set that as my spawn real quick. Can't forget to do that. Alrighty bro, I wanna sell this. I'm gonna sell this bronze hammer. Like two silver or whatever. A bronze war axe. <clears throat> 22 damage. This one does 24. So we're gonna sell this one. <clears throat> 561 silver. Sell a bronze hatchet. I maybe thought we can use that to cut down trees, but this is not Minecraft, so. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm ever gonna not use my magic ever outside of battle or at all, so I don't think I'm gonna stop using my magic, put it that way. Uh, we did uh, level up here, so I think we got some more attributes here. Let's get strength up to like 12, my dexterity. Um, after effects the damage from bows adds to your movement speed important for Oscars. I'm gonna add like for the 
days. <clears throat> total amount of health you have. Let's go with 14 of those. Wisdom, total amount of mana you have and effects of potency for spells. Let's get that to like 14 as well. Let's get that to 14. I'll make sure I level up my stats equally. I don't want to have one skill or more overpowered than the next because then that becomes a problem later on. You'll notice that if you play this game that that becomes a problem because you only have one stat that can actually help you in battle. Say you build up your, um, <clears throat> okay, let's say you build up your constitution all the way up there. You're going to have a lot of health, but the defect is going to be that your strength and all your other stats are not going to be as high. I mean, you could sit there and level the two stats at once, but that's probably the max. If you try to level up three, the two, two of your skills are going to be severely under leveled and, uh, yeah, you don't want to just kind of like pick and choose. You kind of need all your stats and uh, all your skills at the highest percentage possible. So why not just level them all up at the same time? And it is dark in this bitch. Use this fucking torch. Hopefully it lights up. <clears throat> that guy took a lot of him. So we got some newer enemies over here. They're a little bit stronger. This is a vast plane here. This is a pretty vast plane. I will not lie here. I do want to see what's uh, what I can find. Um, doesn't look like there's much. <clears throat> it's a roper. I've, I've vanquished a roper. Okay. Uh, and that is an axe wing. My magic advanced to level 13. So I'm pretty close to getting that level 15 spell. Okay, I got him. It takes very little of my mana to actually uh, use my Frost Bolt. And it's probably the most op thing in my deck. I could use my Axe, my shit like that, but I'm gonna use those when I get into a cave. I have a little bitch. I like how they just come out of nowhere and just kinda smack your shit real quick. Um, but yeah. I don't know why I'm walking towards the edge here. I'm gonna eat one of these apples since I have like 25 of them. Let's get away from the edge. There doesn't seem to be anything here. Let's save game, of course. Alright, so I'm seeing a little fort here. There's nothing in these. Here's a boat, though. <clears throat> Fortunately, I'm not allowed to take it. Um, I don't think I want to take that quite yet. It looks like we're going to have to ascend down here, so let's do it. <clears throat> this probably was the place she was talking about, the southeast cave. Not a cave, it's really more of like a basement type shit. An attic dungeon or whatever. Pretty sure there are real dungeons in this game. Caves are just caves. But they're gonna be dungeons until I find one. I need to know what a dungeon looks like. It's probably gonna be super intense. <clears throat> Alrighty. An acid blob? That guy could have killed me then. If he had enough like range and enough speed. He's super slow, so he could you he couldn't you couldn't quite catch. What the fuck? We have an egg. Description healing properties. Uh, there's a thorn buckler, six defense. The buckler that I have on only has four defense, so we're just gonna take all of it. I don't see why not take the apple, too. Um, so this probably is not the cave. <laughs> She was talking about this is just like a mini one of these areas usually pop up like that's like a stairs leading down below it's usually just something's very short um so now that i know that i gotta go all the way back up past the past the town past the garia um we're gonna just explore the floor base of this uh, area right here we're gonna explore all of uh, <clears throat> agaria and uh, then that's when we'll move on to a new uh like type area so yeah we're gonna we're gonna look at pretty much most of Aga agaria before we go on to Felrin, um, because Felrin looks a little bit crazy as fuck, and we haven't seen the other half of Agaria quite yet, so that is going to be my goal. Uh, we need to start, uh, if we're going to be LPing this game, we need to start setting goals, guys. <clears throat> 
So I'm gonna say one of my goals is to see the other side of Agaria here. <clears throat> Watch out for most of these guys here, because most of these guys are pretty, pretty brutal. Um, well, we probably shouldn't search along the bases. Bam, green snake. <clears throat> I think I leveled up my magic or something like that. Let's check out my spells. Still locked, <clears throat> but uh, we earned two spells pretty quickly. Um, here's a level 12 spell. For some reason, that shit's unlocked as well. I mean, locked as well. Um, let's go with attributes. Let's go with one each. <clears throat> you know how I do it. Um, skills. Um, I have 13 with the magic. Uh, magic staves. And, uh, I never knew that's how you spell staffs. <laughs> With the V? Fucking mind blown. <clears throat> Alrighty, we already know about all this shit, so let's go ahead and just go off the ridge here. Uh. Oh shit, the lag. There was this, uh, that one cave over here. I remember that much. Um, but we're not going to do that again. We're just kind of going to go past it. There's my house. My aim is like stupid good in this game. Surprisingly. Okay, that's nothing. I like how the carcasses kind of stay behind. A goblin minion vanquished. <clears throat> so here we are on the other side of Agaria. Um, fighting off little goblins and shit. Just trying to rack it. It's basically the goal. I have a lot of health potions and minimal items and stuff like that. So it's pretty good for me to just farm while I can. Even though it's not that necessary in this game. Farming isn't that hard. Nor is it that easy. Um, you just kind of have to do it, I guess. That's the only way. <laughs> That's the only way I can explain that. Just do it. It's better than swinging a sword because I would have been uh, really complicated with that thing. This looks like this could lead to somewhere. Maybe. Hello? Is this a bridge? It's taking us somewhere. <clears throat> this is still a Garia. Huh. This is a pathway of some sort. If we keep going, we might find valuables. So there's two ways to branch off here. I guess I could start using um, Elder and Staff info. I don't know why I even picked that. I'm going to drop that. I'm going to go with this Iron War Axe. You need 31. <sighs> wow, to equip that shit. I'll equip this Thorn Buckler, though. And uh, we'll equip the Cedar Bow. How much damage? Hmm. I DK about that. How much damage do these do? Uh, I don't know, guys. I really don't know here. We just have to see who the fuck was here. Somebody was just camping out here and shit. <clears throat> so we found a little passageway. That's pretty neat. Uh, this is still a Garia. Oh, it's just it's an overrun, like kind of like tavern. The music has changed here. There is definitely something important. Mm. Mm. We got a fire arrow. Got some more meat.
Oh, they're fucking everywhere, yo. Holy shit. This place is a, like a cavern of some sort. There's a switch. I'm trying to save my own ass here. I want all the valuables I can get from this place. So we were over there. <clears throat> I'm guessing this is where this that little cave was gonna take us. Something like that. Try to fool me. Can't dodge me. Um, all this blood on my hands, though. Okay. Let's leave, because I do want to see what was in that, um... Hey, bud. The door, it's open. Thank you so much. Please, could you take me to my uh, mentor, Gyrus? He's a lumberjack and he lives in the cabin northeast of here. I'm gonna say, man, I don't want to go alone. Gyrus would be happy to see you. Blah, 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 blah. Man, I can't get what's in that chest. <clears throat> Should have said no. Fuck off me. Oh my god, because see, I have him, I can't. Wow. All these valuables are gonna go to waste. Alright, look, bro. You're fucking killing my vibe here. You're, <laughs> you're making it really hard for me to get any gold. Northeast of here, huh? So what was that like a small like little little fort? I think that was like a fort that got taken over. I figured there's no way I was dodging these guys. God damn it, I hate this guy. I can't pick shit up. I forgot I was the one that accepted the request. I hope he like dies somewhere, like seriously. Gets the fuck off of my sack. <laughs> Uh, but it looks like I'm going to end this episode here, and when we come back with um, parts uh, three, I guess, of um, part three of ninth dawn here, we're going to fuck some old shits up. So uh, until then, fans, bye-bye.